she shared and giggled with the other children just like our children do when they have a toy to play with. Later, she had a meal with the other African New Life children, and her stomach was full. She was satisfied, but she knew that she had somebody at home that wasn't satisfied. When I went to say goodbye to her, I wanted one last picture of her with her bear, and she was avoiding me. She wouldn't make eye contact with me, so I pointed to her pocket, and I said, Bear, in Kenya Rondon. Without making eye contact, she pulled out of her pocket a piece of fruit. She had traded her bear for a piece of fruit, because she probably had an auntie or a sibling at home that needed food and was hungry. You have the opportunity to learn more about African New Life back at our table. We also have children available for sponsorship. For $35 a month, you can change the life of a child. Thank you, Jerry and Cindy. I'm going to invite the ushers to come at this time. We're going to take uh, our morning's offering, and then we're going to close in a song. There'll be a, a table back there where you can find out more about African Life Ministries. Uh, my goal would be that every one of us that uh, have an income would be able to uh, help someone who doesn't. Will you bow your heads for a word of prayer? Father, thank you so much for how you've blessed us. And I thank you so much for the blessing of uh, your word and, and the, your servant who shared it with us today. Uh, I thank you, Lord, for First Baptist Church and pray, as we have prayed before today, that uh, you would continue to bless, that prayer would become a part of our culture and our expectation and our habits. We ask this, Lord, in your name. Amen.
table back there. Our son's name is Fred, and we've been sponsoring him for, oh, I think, I know, Fred, <laughs> for at least six years now, and it is such a blessing. So, and we always find the money every month, no matter what's going on. God bless you.